In these NBA playoffs, there's been many rising stars balling out of their minds in these playoffs. One person comes to mind, Donovan Mitchell. This man has been going crazy, literally carrying his team on his back. Unfortunately, they, they lost in Game 7 versus the Denver Nuggets. In today's video, we're going to be talking about why Donovan Mitchell is the next Dwayne Wade. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Will, and we're back in good in the wood. Another video, and look, Donovan Mitchell, everything about his game relates to Dwayne Wade to me. Now, before we get into this video, if y'all new to my channel, I want to make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Please subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get a thousand subscribers by the end of this year. Thank y'all so much for the support. Now, there's many aspects of Donovan Mitchell's game that compares to D Wade. First of all, Donovan Mitchell is has a very quick step and loves getting to the basket. Very athletic, just like Dwayne Wade back in his prime. D Wade was very athletic and explosive. The only difference between Donovan Mitchell and D Wade, in my opinion, Donovan Mitchell has a better shot. Like he shoot the ball better, but he can also create a shot just like D Wade can. And D Wade was not afraid of the moment in big moments, like in the playoffs. Donovan Mitchell is the same person. Unfortunately, Donovan Mitchell doesn't have any help on his team. I feel like Utah needs to give Donovan, Donovan Mitchell some help. If they don't give him help, he will leave. And later on in this video, I will tell you what team he should go to. Now, the thing is with between Donovan Mitchell and D-Wade, Donovan Mitchell, he was in the dunk contest. He's very athletic dunking the ball like crazy but he can shoot the ball he's very streaky with d wade d wade was great at doing fake plays like fake pump face he was so great at doing that and he was so great at doing circuit shots like every game he would do some kind of circuit shot donovan mitchell is like that if you see him like play every game like a you like a utah dash man if you see him play every game donovan mitchell would make some crazy acrobatic shot and also, Donovan Mitchell is not afraid of the moment, just like Dwayne Wade wasn't. D. Wade literally had one of the best finals performances in NBA history but behind Michael Jordan and LeBron, where he averaged 35 versus Dallas when he had Shaq back in 06 and brought him back from down 2-0 to win that series in 6. That was one of the best performances in NBA history by D. Wade. Donovan Mitchell has that potential. The problem is he doesn't have any help. Now, the team, if if Utah doesn't get any help for him, Donovan Mitchell, I consider you should go to Miami Heat and play with Jimmy Butler. Now, obviously, they will have to package probably Tyre, Tyler Hero and Bam to do so. Man, Donovan Mitchell and Jimmy Butler on the same team, and that's going to be tough. I, I feel like Miami, and this year, this year I feel like Miami's going to go all the way. But if Donovan Mitchell goes to Miami, definitely, definitely go all the way. But honestly, Donovan Mitchell should stay on Utah, but they need to give him some help. Rudy Gobert and Donovan Mitchell, I don't know how that, how that coexists, because especially what happened. So like I said, like, Donovan Mitchell, D-Wade relates so much because Donovan Mitchell loves to get to the basket, loves to finish at will. He also has a great sidestep shot. He has good handle, and he he's very streaky, and he loves to take over games. He, he literally backpacked his, this Utah Jazz team. D-Wade did the same thing with Miami. They, they relate so much, and he has a nice Euro step. Donovan Mitchell is literally D-Wade 2.0, man. Utah, get him some help. He was exhausted in Game 7. He was exhausted. Donovan Mitchell can win a championship, but I do not believe he can win a championship on Utah. There you have it, man. This is why Donovan Mitchell is literally D-Wave 2.0. His game resembles so much. The only difference is Donovan Mitchell shoots better. But D-Wave had amazing mid-range shot, just, just like Donovan Mitchell did. 
Donovan Mitchell, you can argue he's more athletic, but D Wade in his prime was amazingly athletic also. So that's why he's D Wade 2.0. I hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. I know it's another short video. Comment down below if, what you think Donovan Mitchell compares to. I, obviously, I just see a lot of D Wade, you know what I'm saying? But I appreciate y'all for this video. Again, if y'all new to my channel, make sure y'all like this video. Make sure y'all check out my other video in the description. And thank y'all for tuning in. It's been what Will. I'm out.